Hello students, welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Shukalan Mistre. In today's video, I am going to discuss about PSA 2014 previous year question on the topic theory of equation. Okay, I am uploading PSC previous year question with solution on different topic. So subscribe my channel for preparing SSC and PSC exam and share with your friends. Okay, so let's start. So what is given if alpha, beta, gamma, delta be the roots of the equation x to the power 4 minus x cube plus 2x square plus x plus 1 is equal to 0, then we have to find the value of alpha plus 1, beta plus 1, gamma plus 1, delta plus 1. So what is given here? Here it is given that alpha, beta, gamma, delta are the roots of the equation x to the power 4 minus x cube plus 2x square plus x plus 1. Take AG equation, AG equation root alpha beta gamma delta. So this can be written as x minus alpha, x minus beta, x minus gamma into x minus delta. Take since alpha beta gamma delta are these are the roots of this equation. So this can be written as x minus alpha into x minus beta into x minus gamma into x minus delta. Okay. Take. Now, we have to find the value of alpha plus 1 into beta plus 1 into gamma plus 1 into delta plus 1. Trick to that. Just jay kuna actor factor ke tumi 0 karo. Suppose alpha plus 1 ke ami 0 kochi. Take. That means alpha is equal to kiyoche minus 1. Take. Clear? Tahole ami ki kurgo. Just you put x is equal to minus 1 in this relation. Suppose this is equation 1. Tick. Dharo yelkom jidi be korte bale. Suppose alpha find the value of alpha plus 2, beta plus 2, gamma plus 2, delta plus 2. Tahole ami ki kurgo. Jekon actor factor ke 0 kurgo. Tick hache. So alpha plus 2 is equal to 0. That means alpha is equal to minus 2. So you put x is equal to minus 2. Correct or clear? So for this problem, we have to put x is equal to minus 1. Okay. So putting, putting x is equal to alpha plus 1 is equal to 0. That is alpha is equal to minus 1. So putting x is equal to minus 1. Tick. So minus 1 to the power 4 minus minus 1 cube plus 2 minus 1 square plus minus 1 plus 1 so that equal to minus 1 minus alpha minus 1 minus beta minus 1 minus gamma minus 1 minus delta so this implies 1 plus 1 plus 2 plus 1 minus 1 cancel out tick Okay, so that equal to just taking minus sign common from each factor. Okay. So what do we get? So 1 plus alpha. From here taking minus sign common. So minus economy minus sign common niche minus economy minus sign economy minus. So minus a plus plus a minus a minus minus a plus. Okay. So that will be plus. Take so. 1 plus alpha into 1 plus beta into 1 plus gamma into 1 plus delta. So 1 plus 1, 2 plus 2, that is 4. So you get 1 plus alpha into 1 plus beta into 1 plus gamma into 1 plus delta. So that equal to 4. Okay. So which option is correct? So option B is the correct answer okay clear so next example so what is given here we have to find the nature of this of the roots of this equation so what is the equation here the equation is x cube minus 3x plus 1 is equal to 0 we have to find the nature of the roots of this equation. Okay. So let fx is equal to let fx 
is equal to x cube minus 3x plus 1. Take just you replace x by minus x. So what do we get? Minus x cube, that is minus x cube plus 3x. I just we replace x by minus x. I mean, x so jaga minus x replace kochi. So minus x cube, that is minus x cube, minus x cube, tick, minus plus 3x, tick, plus 1. Okay? Tick, e bar da ko, e ra ki sign ache, plus sign. Ekhen kodu glo sign plus minus, ekhen e da sign change hoche, minus plus, ekhen e da sign change hoche. So, there are two sign chains, okay? So we have two positive root. Economy f x that way f plus x. So ki have two positive roots. Take a but a ko minus x ko we have minus take a plus after sign chains. I'm a sign chains koto yaga hoche shed amache kutal plus plus. So there is no sign chains. Okay. So only one negative. Take suppose sign change go plus plus minus plus. Tell the plus take a plus, no sign change, plus take a minus, actor sign change, minus take a plus, actor sign change. So two jaga sign change. Okay. Take so what is the degree? The degree of the equation is three. Degree of the equation fx is three. Okay, so, so there is no imaginary root. The lambda imaginary root key could have how to find imaginary root just degree theke negative root or positive root subtract karo. How to find imaginary roots? Imaginary roots that means just trick to degree of the equation minus number of positive roots. Take plus number of negative roots okay so here the degree of the equation is 3 positive root is 2 negative root is 1 so 2 plus 1 3 so 3 minus 3 is so there is no imaginary root okay so this equation has two positive roots and one negative root a equation is zero root thakte pare no dekho zero root means just you replace x by 0. Jiri x is equal to 0, replace jiri tumi x is equal to 0 put kule puro term ta 0 ho jab. If we get this term is 0, then we say x is equal to 0 is a root of this equation. Okay. Then how much equation ta ki da What is the equation? x cube minus 3x plus 1. x cube minus 3x plus 1. So if we put x is equal to 0, what do we get? If we put x is equal to 0, so 0 minus 0 plus 1 that means 0 Mara 0 pachi no okay jodi x is equal to 0 put kole polynomial to 0 ho hai tokhon x is equal to 0 that is 0 is a root of this equation you know this okay so this equation has no zero root okay so fx is equal to 0 so it is very important note so fx is equal to zero has no zero root clear so ultimately what is the conclusion what is it? this equation has two positive roots one negative roots and no imaginary root okay what is the conclusion so conclusion Two, what we say so fx is equal to 0 fx is equal to 0 has two positive roots okay one negative roots it and no imaginary root so which option is correct 
टू पॉजिटिव वन नेगेटिव टू पॉजिटिव वन नेगेटिव सो ऑप्शन ए इज द कारेक्ट एंसर ओके क्लियर सो नेक्स्ट एग्जाम्पल so what is given here it is given that alpha beta gamma delta are the roots of the equation what is the equation the equation is x to the power 4 plus p x cube plus q x square plus r x plus s is equal to 0 a equation er roots gulo bola ache alpha beta gamma delta so from the relation between roots and coefficient what we can write we can write summation alpha that is alpha plus beta plus gamma plus delta so that equal to minus p thick summation alpha beta that is alpha beta plus alpha gamma plus alpha delta plus beta gamma plus beta delta plus gamma delta so that equal to q thick minus coefficient of x cube divided by coefficient of x to the power four plus Coefficient of x to the power four by coefficient coefficient of x square divided by coefficient of x to the power four. Next summation alpha beta gamma. So that equal to minus coefficient of x divided by coefficient of x to the power four. That is minus r. And alpha beta gamma delta. So that equal to constant term by coefficient of x to the power four. That is s. Okay. so it should be note that you know that what is the short trick note that summation alpha square beta gamma so that equal to summation alpha into summation alpha beta gamma minus 4 alpha beta gamma delta so this is the trick you have to remember this result okay this problem from symmetric function okay summation alpha square beta so that equal to summation alpha into summation alpha beta gamma minus 4 alpha beta gamma delta okay so what is summation alpha summation alpha is minus p summation alpha beta gamma that is minus r And alpha beta gamma delta that is s. So p r minus four s. So option B is the correct answer. Okay. So you have to note this result. Summation alpha square beta gamma is equal to summation alpha into summation alpha beta gamma minus four alpha beta gamma delta. Okay. Clear. so next example what is given here it is given that alpha be an imaginary root of this equation so since since alpha is an imaginary root imaginary root of the equation x to the power 11 minus 1 is equal to 0 then all roots so what are the roots of this equation what are the roots of this equation all roots are 1 alpha alpha square up to alpha to the power 10 okay if alpha be an imaginary root of x to the power n minus 1 is equal to 0 then the roots are 1 alpha alpha square up to alpha to the power n minus 1 right so since alpha is an imaginary root of this equation x to the power 11 minus 1 is equal to 0 then all roots are 1 alpha alpha square up to alpha to the power 10 thick so what you can write so therefore we can write x to the power 11 minus 1 so that equal to x minus 1 into x minus alpha Into x minus alpha square dot dot x minus alpha to the power ten because the roots of this equation are one alpha alpha square up to alpha to the power ten. Okay, 
So x to the power 11 minus 1, so that can be written as x minus 1 into x minus alpha into x minus alpha square into x minus alpha q up to x minus alpha to the power 10. Tick. Okay. So now we have to find the value of alpha plus 1 into alpha square plus 1 into alpha to the power 10 plus 1. Right. Okay. So this can be written as x to the power 11 minus 1 divided by divided by x minus 1 so that equal to x minus alpha into x minus alpha square dot dot x minus alpha to the power 10 okay the whole term location alpha plus 1 into alpha alpha square plus 1 dotted alpha to the power 10 plus 1 so we have to put x is equal to minus 1 okay so put x is equal to minus 1 so we get minus 1 to the power 11 minus 1 divided by minus 1 minus 1 so that equal to minus 1 minus alpha minus 1 minus alpha square dot dot minus 1 minus alpha to the power 10 okay so this will be minus minus 1 to the power 11 that is minus 1 so minus 1 minus 1 that is minus 2 divided by minus 2 so that will be 1 okay that we can call to go term much total 1 2 up to 10 take well 11 term sorry 10 term tick so just taking minus and common from here taking minus and common from here taking minus and common so what we get so so you get 1 plus alpha that will minus minus plus the total 10 term so sign will be positive tick okay so 1 plus alpha 1 plus alpha into 1 plus alpha square dotted 1 plus alpha to the power 10 okay so therefore the value of alpha plus 1 into alpha square plus 1 dotted alpha to the power 10 plus 1 is 1 so which option is correct so option d is the correct answer clear so ask me psc 2014 samosto problem gulo theory of fiction the problem gulo exam is a zero psc 2014 general degree college from the problem gulo me solve for them okay so i think all points are clear next next video the pc pc previous year problem will solve for so subscribe to my channel okay and share with your friends okay this video will be very helpful for preparing ssc exam psc exam okay so thank you so much. Bye.